In this video, I'm going to show you how you can free up some space in Google Drive. There are a couple of ways that you can do it in this video, so use one of them. Now, the first thing that you need to understand is if you go to your storage here in the bottom left hand corner, you will have a maximum amount of storage you're allowed. For me, that is 100 gigabyte because if I click get more storage, you can see I currently pay for the 100 gigabyte plan and I pay £1.59 per month. Now, if you just want to pay, you'll get more storage, you'll get more benefits, and I think the price is quite reasonable. Now, if you don't want to pay and you want to stick to your standard free plan, then you can free up some space in these following ways. So the first way would just be to simply delete any files or folders inside of Google Drive that you don't currently want. You can do this manually. So let's say all of these photos here, this whole folder, we can just go ahead and click on it and move to bin and it will then move that folder to the bin. Now, I don't think that will affect the storage just yet because you need to actually go to your bin and clear out your bin so the storage is actually gone down because your files will be held for 60 days, I do believe. So you need to go ahead and go to your bin and clear your bin as well. But that's how you can do it manually. If you want to do this kind of like automatically and free up a lot of space at once, go to storage and you'll then see kind of like what Google products make up your storage. For me, it is Google Photos at 59 gigabyte, and then I've got Google Drive here. So even if I was removing files from Google Drive, it wouldn't actually take the storage percentage down that we could use that much. So we can click clean up space and that will open this window where Google will suggest items that we can clear up. So we've got spam emails, which you might as well delete. So you can click review you can check all of these and it's not going to free up much data, but it's worth it anyway. So once you've done that, you can check out these other suggestions. This one I would look at large photos and videos, 10 gigabyte. It's going to show you all of the large photos and videos you have. You can review them and delete them. I'm not going to click on it though, because it will be personal videos of mine. And then you've got clean up by service. You can click Google photos. It will then show you your Google photos, but obviously I don't want to delete my photos. So I'm not going to do that. You can then go to Google Drive and delete any large files that will affect your storage in Drive. So this one is 353 megabytes. If I don't need it, I can review it, click on it and delete it. So for the video, we'll just click on it, we'll click delete and permanently delete. And it's then going to free up that amount of storage. So you can do this manually. You can do this with the storage manager or you can upgrade your Google Drive plan. Those are three ways you can do it. I hope that helped you out.